a vending machine. All right, I think it's time. Now we may proceed. We may proceed. Earlier, when you passed by the park, I saw a tree shaking. In here. There it is. <laughs> like, tapping A. Yeah, I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, you probably won't even need. Yeah, you probably won't, you probably won't need to even look for the shells. Anyone paying attention will find them with plenty of time. Okay. It's a weird shaking tree. Uh, all right. Give the lady our, all the all the trash we found. Eight dollars, yo. Eight dolans. Gave us a bandage. Fancy's sketching away. Who's this guy? <sighs> oh, hey! What's up? What are you doing here, Kel? You from around this part of town? Oh, whoa, I didn't expect to see you here, Jay. Sonny, this is Jay. He's the captain of the football team in my high school. I didn't know you played basketball, too. Uh, I'm just here to kill time. More of a hobby than anything. Trying out for the basketball team this year, right, Kel? Maybe you can teach me some of your tricks. Okay. Yeah, definitely. That sounds like fun. Hmm? Monica? <laughs> Monica just like say something and then mute? She did. <laughs> she was like, yeah, and then muted. <laughs> but maybe another time. My childhood friend Sonny is here leaving town in the next few days, so we're hanging out all day today. Oh, she said, be right back. Okay, I didn't hear the be right back part. I just heard, that. <laughs> I'll definitely catch up with you later, though. Sure, we can eat something up next week. Same time, same place? Yep, sounds good. See you then. All right, well, now we gotta look for Aubrey and her friends. Gotta look for those fucking people. Oh. I think they're in the tree. <laughs> hmm. Looks like Aubrey isn't here. Oh wait, I know you. Your name's Charlie, right? I see you hanging around with I, saying, I see you hanging around Aubrey sometimes. You know where she is? You know, Charlie. I can tell you're not really the mean type of person. Aubrey took something important from Basil, and we need to get it back. Is there any way you can help us? Okay, well, that, that, that's a person in there. There is a, there is... Who, what, where, now, what, what'd you do that for? Ah! If it isn't killing that weird knife guy, we're the adversaries of the great and mighty Angel. Finally, it is time for you to meet your doom. Angel, we don't have time for this. I don't even know if this is a girl or boy. <laughs> we just want to find Aubrey. Do you know where she is? You seek Aubrey, do you? Interesting. I'll tell you what I know. But first, you must best me in battle. Battle? But I don't want to punch a kid. Oh, okay, he's a child. <laughs> you won't be able to lay a finger on me. Come on, let's sick him, Charlie. Okay, he is a okay. Yeah, it's a young. It's it's a kid. Okay, it's it's a young boy. Nah, uh, I don't. I got rid of my knife, so I guess I just punch people now. I don't. Are we really just gonna punch a kid? Is that what we're gonna do here? I don't... We could probably just attack Angel, I'm assuming. Charlie's standing there! <gasps> I'm assuming Charlie is not a part of the battle. So, overworld fights are a bit different. Enemies will almost entirely attack Kel before Sunny. Okay. 
because they don't know me. <laughs> you surprise me, Kel. You would make a worthy rival for my master. Oh no, Charlie punched Kel. He did one damage. Well, there he goes. You! You'll pay for this! How could this be? My training was all for nothing. Ow, my head hurts. I'm the one who started it. <laughs> you bully! <sighs> okay, Angel. It's time to be serious now. We beat you and Charlie. So tell us where Aubrey is. Huh. <laughs> a promise is a promise, I suppose. I'll honor my word and tell you what I know. The truth is, Aubrey is... Somewhere. In faraway town. Probably. Dang it, Angel! You better not be messing around or else. I told you I'd tell you what I know. And the truth is, I don't know anything. Angel, you better tell us where she is now. Or else tell everyone about that time you wet your bed at summer camp. Huh? What? You can't do that! That's cheating! Anyway, I really don't know. Maybe you can ask the master, the Maverick. He's the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that myself. The Maverick? Oh no. Isn't that weird kid? Mikel? Don't you dare call him by that name! You would take great offense to that! I see. So it is him. Where can I find Mikel? I mean, uh, the Maverick. I'll tell you what I know, but you'll have to fight me first. Or I can tell everyone about that time you- Gah! Yeah! Okay, fine, I'll talk. Master went to the fountain of the faraway plaza. He said he was going to meet some girl there, so for a date or something. Ugh. Disgusting. Come on, Sonny. Let's go to the faraway plaza. I think we're done here. But wait! I have to go deliver that the meds to that old lady. Just remembered that, actually. Can I still go do that? I can still go do that! Yay! <laughs> Woo! Grandma, I have your meds! <laughs> I still have your meds, Grandma. <laughs> Grandma's meds have been delivered. Excuse me, thank you so much. You've been a big help. It's nice to see the youth helping young folks. You're all gonna help anytime. <sighs> there you go. We still helped Graham Graham. Just in time for us to beat up some school children, eh, chat? The Maverick is a fucking baller. If you don't give her the meds, she dies on day three. That's something some of this game would do. Alright, so we have to go to the Maverick. I actually totally forgot where the Maverick was. Let me talk to Angel again. Where's the Maverick? Teacher went to the fountain at Faraway Plaza. Oh, okay. So we gotta go back to the plaza. Alright. I'm fucking hyped for the Maverick. The Maverick's probably someone lame. The fountain. There's a fountain here? This is the plaza, right? Oh, the fountain. Right. Oh my god. <laughs> then I told him, it's not Maverick. It's the Maverick. Oh, the Maverick. You're so funny. Oh, <laughs> what an amazing story. Girls, girls, please. There's enough for me to go around. This song is called Cram It Wad. C Cram It Wad? What the wad? Mikel? What are you doing? Ugh. If it isn't Kel, my arch nemesis. Finally here to admit defeat, are you? I don't have time for this, Mikel. We're looking for Aubrey. Have you seen her around? S Stop calling me that! I cast away that name a long time ago. Mikel, do you know where she is or not? Again with that godforsaken name! How dare you make a fool out of me! I, the Maverick, will not stand for this! Prepare to face your doom! Oh, Maverick's voice is hurting my fucking throat. Oh god. Uh, 
Ugh. Watch this, ladies. I'll wipe the floor with this loser. Please, Mikel. Don't do this to yourself. I'm going to ask one more time. Fight me, you wad! Don't be a chicken! <sighs> Are you really going to do this? Okay, then. Come on, Sonny. Let's take him down. <laughs> oh, Kel, you pitiful fool. You don't stand a chance against the Maverick. Uh. Tag. Encourage. My attack rose. Fuck you. Oh no, Kel's attack fell. All right, Maverick, you piece of shit. Damn, Maverick's taking a bit. Oh shit, all right, that could do a decent amount of damage. I'm gonna probably heal Kel. Huh, not bad. But this fight's just getting started. All right, so they also said that healing items go first, and that's a snack. Okay, toys are what heals. There you go. Healing items go first in the overworld. Maverick starts making fun of Kel. Kel feels angry. Oh, shit. <laughs> But I must tell you, while you were fooling around and playing sports, I was honing my techniques just for this moment. <laughs> while you were playing sports, I was practicing the blade. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never reach my level of skill. You're going down, Kel. Oh my god. While you were practicing sports. I studied the blade. Ha! It's not all you got. I've only been using 10% of my power. I hate this kid. <laughs> I actually despise this child. Behold, my final form. He's one of those kids. He's just fucking banned kid. <laughs> Bitch, you're regretting your decision now. I'm just way too cool for you. You're nothing but a loser. How did he get girls? <laughs> Mavis attack whiffed. It's only a matter of time before you tire yourselves out. My victory is imminent. <laughs> He's an anime kid, he owns his harem from luck. <sighs> I'll admit, I'm impressed. But you're still light years away from defeating me. <laughs> uh, uh, no, this is impossible, improbable, absolutely inconceivable! Fucking lose. God, no, I won't let it end like this. No, it can't be over for me. People of Earth, oh my god. <laughs> Lend me your strength. <laughs> Share your energy with me. Oh my god, what is actually happening? <laughs> Ew, what is with this guy? He's so lame. This isn't worth $10. Let's get out of here. Oh, he was paying. He is a band. He was paying them to stay around. <laughs> Ladies, please come back. I have more money. <laughs> <sighs> that was a wig! Mikel. There is no one here by that name! Please, don't ask you for anything in my life. 
Just tell us where Aubrey is and we'll go. Okay, fine. I do happen to know where she is and I'll tell you. On one condition. You must call me my true name. The Maverick. Oh, forget it. Let's just go find Kim. She probably knows where Aubrey is. Her and Vance are major sugar heads, so... I have a hunch that they'll probably be somewhere near Candy. <laughs> Good game, Maverick. I like that his music starts every time you talk to him. Wow, that boy with the blonde wig is so cool. I wish I had his confidence. <laughs> they're just too they're too weak for the Maverick. Yeah, the Maverick. Man, we're pretty lucky we survived the Maverick. Alright, so we got, they should be around candy, so that means they'll probably be in the candy store. You can throw a coin into the fountain. Oh, I did find a coin on the ground. We can do that later. Hmm. Now we can advance. They're probably somewhere around here. Oh, hey, there she is. Hurry, Vance. Let's shove it all in our pockets or someone sees us. Hey, Kim, have you seen Aubrey any? Shoot, it's that nerd, Kel. Come on, Vance, we gotta go. Whoa, hold on there. I don't think you paid for those. Get out of the way, nerd. You don't know me. Hey, hey hold on. I'm not here to snitch. Fine, we just need to find Aubrey. You know where she is? Huh? Aubrey? I don't know anything about that. And even if I did, I wouldn't tell you. Huh. <sighs> enough of this for today. Kim, let's make a deal. You tell me where Aubrey is, and I won't turn you in for stealing all that candy. I thought you said you weren't a snitch! And I don't need to be if you just tell me where Aubrey is. You two again! Thought I told you to never come back in here. Smiley, smiley! <laughs> uh, uh, uh oh. Hand over the stolen candy. Don't make me call the cops on you kids. Smiley, smiley. We've been busted. Fine! Here's your stupid candy! Come on, Vance. Let's get out of this dump. Great, how are we supposed to know where fucking Aubrey is? Haha, <laughs> serves you right. Wait. How do we find out where Aubrey is now? Ugh. Come on, Sonny. Let's follow them. I'm back. Hi. What'd I miss? We were, ch we were chasing Vance and, um, Kim to figure out if they know where Aubrey is. The Maverick, we beat him up, but he was like, I'll only tell you if you call me the Maverick. And we're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Hold up one sec, Sonny. I think I have an idea. I'll lure them with candy. Sorry for the hold up. Let's go catch up with Kim and Vance. She missed the Maverick. Yeah, everyone in the chat's like, Monica missed the Maverick. I'm glad. Uh, sorry, Vance. No candy today. No. Not again. <laughs> I don't know how much longer I can last. We're going to die. Ah, uh, let's just go home. We're gonna be late for dinner. Sorry, Sonny. Can't buy Hero's gift. Let my money at home. Also, Cal buys candy. Maybe he didn't have enough money for the gift, to be fair. Because wasn't the gift like 30 bucks? Like, the candy was like a dollar. So I think he just didn't have enough money. Wait, Kim! I have something for you! You again, Kel? What the heck do you want, you bully? Tell us where Aubrey is, and I'll give you this whole big bag of candy. Okay, you bought a big bag. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute here. How did you? You should have had that money. Really? The whole bag? I mean, wait. You can't buy us off of candy. What do you take us for? I don't know, Kim. We haven't had candy for an entire week. And there's a whole bag right in front of us. How we have to pay old? for it. How old are all these kids? Vance looks like he's like a fucking, like, 
25 year old man he has a beard <laughs> can you at least ask if he has taffy in there <laughs> stop it vance we have to stay strong 15 to 16 okay so all these they're like all teenagers we'll be able to have all the candy we want if we go to dad's house okay i'll do it for you sis kim vance i'm waiting <laughs> like we'd accept candy from a bunch of nerds oh man Really? I was, I was sure that would work. This is a waste of time. Let's get out of here. Wait! Please, Kim. He's the only lead we've got. Please take the big bag of candy. We... We even have Taffy in here. Did someone say Taffy? <laughs> I see. <laughs> that changes everything. <laughs> Fine. You really want to know that badly, huh? Let's settle this with our fists! If you win, I'll tell you where Aubrey is. But if we win, you give us that bag of taffy and never talk to us ever again. Wait a sec, there's no need to fight. You just tell me where she is, I'll give you this whole bag. But, I want to fight. Come on, put them up, you two! It's time to duke it out! Ugh, what is it with you guys in fighting? Well, guess we have no choice. Come on, Sonny. You know the drill. Oh, this is what they look like? <laughs> I'll show you the sizes and everything. How about lose a lot to nerds like you? Oh no. He's low. Have a bandage, Kel. <laughs> Cause you're my friend. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> oh god, no. They're really beating him up. They're doing so much damage to him. Dora Cal, I'll keep healing you. <laughs> I'm just running towards him like, here. <laughs> I have a band. Oh, God. Cal, no. Dora, I have a plan. I have an expert plan to win, Monica. Oh, yeah? <laughs> the expert strategy. Cal so, gives me encouragement, which increases Sonny's attack. Oh, no, Cal's sad. This was, this was a smart plan by me. Because now I will attack! They're not expecting an attack from me, Monica! <gasps> your face... Your face annoys me! I'll be right back. They attack from me, Kia! <sighs> Alright, encourage again! Keep giving me the... Oh, I can't go any higher. Okay, I'm gonna go higher. It's only gonna be once. Alright. Yeah, see? Now I'm doing fat damage! Kia! Sunny attack! Don't worry, Kel, I got you! I'll heal you up! Ugh, still nerds! Alright, we just got beat up Vance now. Vance scratches his belly. Oh, I can calm him down, too. Oh, no, I can't. I can only calm myself down. Oh, okay. All right, Kel, let's beat him up. All right, beat him up. Yeah, Sonny's like... Why are they only attacking Kel? Sonny's like a little wimp boy who hasn't been outside in years, so they're like, meh. Yeah, see, everyone mostly has a qualm with Kel is the problem. No one really has a problem with Sonny because no one talked to Sonny. He didn't like it. Sonny's just like an outsider. So they're like, whatever. <laughs> Ouch. That hurts. Alright, this guy's easy. This guy's a fucking baby, man. Bah. Dang, all I wanted was some taffy. <sighs> Can't believe he lost. We could never let Aubrey know about this. Come on, Kim, we gotta go home. It's almost time for dinner, and Mom's gonna be really mad if we're late. 
Shoot, let's get out of here. What? Hey! Wait, where do you think you're going? We won, so you need to tell us where Aubrey is. Oh, yeah, that's right. Are they really not gonna tell us? Oh, Aubrey's at the church. The one near her house. Huh? Aubrey's at church? Hey, don't look at me. You're the one who wanted to know. Also, if she asks who told you, tell her it wasn't me. Say it was... Mikel or something. Come on, Kim, we gotta scoot. You know mom gets over late. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Let's go. Smell you later, nerds. Losing to them gives you the achievement, nerd. <laughs> no, I'm not a nerd. Oh, nuts, they took the big bag of candy while I wasn't looking. Still have got some sticky fingers. Oh well, at least we know where Aubrey is now. At least I think we do. I can't really imagine Aubrey at church. I'll believe it when I see it. Damn, I can't believe Monica missed the Maverick again! You know what I'm saying, Maverick? Go to the picnic basket. Bam, 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 bam. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 chat. Do, 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 do. <sighs> chat, look at us run. Chat, why don't you run? Why don't you run with me? Run faster than the car! No! <laughs> oh, wait. The one by her house. Wait, not by my house. My bad. I must really love the traffic cone. I I have the ex, I have the instinct to cut it. But I can't. Oh, this game comes to console soon, like Undertale. It is. It's coming to Switch. They announced that like a uh, think a month ago. It's coming to Switch, like this spring. Wait, so the one by her house? That means one of those houses was Aubrey's. Aubrey's at the church, apparently. Okay. <clears throat> Well, here we are. This really is the last place I would expect her. I'm kind of skeptical, actually. Might be a trap. I'll open the door a little to take a peek. Hmm. Looks normal to me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh! There she is on the right! Hmm. She's just... Sitting there, all normal. So weird. <laughs> yeah, I feel pretty bad about interrupting this. We should probably wait until the sermon's over or something. What, what do I, okay. Let's just go do something else then. Hold on, Sonny, let's wait until the sermon's over. Oh, okay. So, uh, read any <coughs> good books lately? <laughs> no. Neither have I. <laughs> I've been trying to buy manga, and uh, it's, we're not trying to. I only really tried like a long time ago. It's decently, decently expensive sometimes, depending on the manga. Mm-hmm. I don't scene have any. I don't have any manga, but I have a few Warrior Cats books. Apparently, a big scene is coming up. Hope I don't get called in a little bit. What? No, but you don't interrupt it though. No, can't interrupt it. Gotta wait. Are we? Are we? Are we supposed to collect that we're supposed to go inside? I think it is over now. Oh, is it over? Oh, did it, Kel? Why am I? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Whoa, I didn't expect you to just walk in like that, Sonny. Well, there's no turning back now. Come on, we have to be really quiet. Oh, I can only walk slowly. <laughs> there's Aubrey. What's a sermon? It's just like where they sit, where they pray, I'm pretty sure. There she oh. is on the right. Let's walk into the pew behind her. Aubrey. Psst. Aubrey. 
What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? We want you to give back Basil's photo album. You're still on about that? That's none of your business. Really? None of my business? Monica, can you please stop chewing so loudly into the mic? Yep. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> we all used to be best friends, but now this is none of my business? Yeah, Cal. Exactly. We used to be friends. You know, Mari would be really sad to hear that. <laughs> really? You really want to bring Mari into this? Who cares what Mari thinks? Mari's dead. What? <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> oh! I didn't think the game was going to shoot me like that. <laughs> I, I didn't think they were just gonna say it, but like, I, I, like I, I OW! It. Hey! <laughs> I feel attacked! I that is, that is pretty fucked though. Aubrey, seriously? What's wrong with you? I get that you have new friends now. You can't just forget your old friends like that. My old friends? My old friends weren't there for me when I needed them. That's what this is all about. When Mari passed on, we were all dealing with our own stuff. We were kids. It was hard. You think it's all so simple? You've always been simple, Cal. So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How could you do that to Basil? You know how important his photo album is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you could just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Basil, and I'm not leaving it to agree to give it back. Ugh. You're so persistent. When Mari died, you moved on so fast. You know why I come here every you know why I come here every week? Even after all this time, I'm still trying to find some peace. But it doesn't look like that's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You and Sunny think you just barge back into my life and tell me what to do? Don't be so naive! You might look different and act different, Aubrey. But you're still the same person. Hmm. <laughs> The Aubrey you knew was long gone. And the Aubrey that was your friend? She's long gone too. Okay. Fine. I get that you're angry. Look, if it's an apology you want, here. I'm sorry, okay? I should have been there for you when we lost Mari. No. I won't accept this. Wait! Where are you going? I can't let you go until you promise to give Basil his photo album back, you thief! What's happening? Basil? Isn't that the boy who I've seen Aubrey and her friends bully? Now she's stealing as well? Oh, these are people. <laughs> Oops. You think you're the good guy, don't you, Cal? And I'm the big bad bully. Here to terrorize poor, defenseless Basil. You're the one hanging out with the psychopath who carries around a knife! Now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that! You're the one who banged, who barged in here! I already said I was sorry for everything. If you want to be a, if you want me to be a bully, then I'll be a bully. You two better come at me quick, or I'll come at you first. Ah! We're fighting in the church. She's being angry. Ah! Ah! We. Uh. 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 uh attack move. 
Ooh, damage. Shouldn't the people try to- Oh! <laughs> Shouldn't the people try to stop this? Look at her clothing. It's completely inappropriate for church. <laughs> and she is showing her midriff to the Lord! <laughs> She's showing her midriff to Jesus! To Jesus. Whoa! I can't believe she'd bring a weapon in here. How uncivilized. Beat her up, Kel! Why are you here? Oh my god, her head butts. God damn it. What do these delinquents what do these delinquents think they're doing? This is a place of worship. Fuck, actually, no, I need to heal you. I need to heal you, bro. <laughs> bro, I got the bandages. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll bandage you up. Oh, my God. Someone needs to stop them. Who are their parents? That's a good question. My mother is not here. <laughs> Why? Why now? That girl's a threat to this neighborhood. There's no hope for sinners like her. Finish it! Oh, finish her! Sonny, go! Kia! Ugh. Forget it. You two aren't worth my time. Ah, uh, ever since her father left. Oh, no. What? Her father left? She's so uncontrollable. Disrespectful. I feel bad for her mother. Oh. Oh. That's why she's like this. Oh. Shoot. I know she's been kind of messed up lately. But I still feel sorry for her. Maybe this was a bad idea. Oh, her father left. Mm hmm Oh. Sorry, Bug. You said that too late. I did not go out the back. I went out the front. Can I go back in the church? I'm just probably going to interrupt <laughs> again. <laughs> Oops. Wait. But, no, I can't, Bug! I can't go out the back. <laughs> oh, huh. <laughs> I've legit never seen anyone just leave. I didn't think- I didn't think I had to go out the back! What the fuck would I do that?! <laughs> <laughs> Why would I go out the back?! <laughs> I came from here! Well, Zero, clearly you aren't like everyone else. <laughs> I mean, I just did the normal thing. Like, I was like, oh, we gotta go after Aubrey. She's sad. You wanna explore the church? I didn't think to explore the church after a girl just ran out of the church. <laughs> sad. Like, I, just, I feel like that's like, I'm immersed. I'm like, oh no, I have to go look for her. I'm not like, this is a video game. I must explore. <laughs> like, yeah. so I was like, I'm not constantly thinking about that. That's, what, that's, what, that's everyone else. Everyone else is like, sorry. Or else like, sorry, Aubrey. I have to explore the church real quick. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> she throw the photos away? <clears throat> I think. You see that? Aubrey just dumped something in her trash can. Let's go check it out. Whoa! I don't believe it! It's Basil's photo album! I can't believe she was just throw it out like that. 
It's a good thing we looked through this trash can. On the bright side, we have Basil's photo album now. It only took us half a day, too. Talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Sonny? Do you want a high five, Kel? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Up high! <laughs> Let's get this back to Basil before it gets dark. He'll be so happy when he sees it. Can I ever go back to the church? That's an option. Bro, go back. They're still continuing the sermon. Jeez, how long is it? God damn, this is a long- <laughs> This is a long ass sermon. They started like a couple hours ago. They're still going. God damn. Maybe I can do it after I give Basil his photo album back. Maybe. And then maybe they'll be done. There's a cat on the house. Knock knock! Basil! His friends Kel and Sonny! Hello there, who are you? Hi, Basil- oh wait. <laughs> You're not Basil. <laughs> I'm sorry, my name is Polly. I'm Basil's caretaker. Oh, hey, Cal. What is it? Hi, Basil. Got your photo album back. Huh? You did? Wow, thank you. Give Basil back his photo album. Basil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? Oh, he seemed to cook just a little too much. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Come on, Sonny, free dinner. I get dinner! Dinner! But you know what? What? Fuck, no. <laughs> Please, make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Wow, oh, it's been a while since I've been in here. There's a lot more plants than used to. Uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there's some that are still, that are still alive from when you guys came here more often. Wow, oh, you guys are dedicated. Yep, that's basil for you. Flowers and photos. Oh, that reminds me. Now we've got your photo in back. We can all go through the photos together. Uh, that's, um, I don't know. It's been a while since you've looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. Um, sure, okay. Oh, fuck no, I'm like super railroaded. I was gonna load my save file to go fucking... <laughs> to go out the cemetery, because I'm like, all I have to do is fight Aubrey, and she's not that hard. I was gonna just speed through to do that, but they're not letting me boss. <laughs> no! <laughs> Here it is. Photo time. Oh my god, they're all in color now. You'll be able to soonish. Okay, so. Because I can just skip through dialogue, I'm pretty sure, if you just click plus. I mean, you can just click, click start. Bro, it's fucking me. <laughs> my first, f my first photo is my best friend Sonny trying out his new violin. Oh, <gasps> violin! Monica, she's not here. <laughs> ah, violin! He started to take lessons again so he could play at recitals with his sister Mari. So exciting. So can, wait, so he can play at recitals with his sister Mari? So he can play at recitals with his sister Mari. So she also played violin. So that confirmed that. They both played violin. Oh my god. <laughs> violin. Stairs. <gasps> Things. Just Kel being Kel. So many party hats. <laughs> Sonny playing a video game on the couch. Sonny's a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I always end up venting him when I get upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. Hold up, I'm going to take a picture of this photo for Monica. Just so that she... Just so that I don't have to explain it to her. There you go. If 
Oh, fuck, no. Wait, there's other people in the back. We're back from the park, but Kel is still full of energy. He challenged Hero to an armor wrestling match, but we all know who's going to win. Please go easy on him, Hero. Oof, sorry, Kel. Better luck next time. Zero's Basil now? No, this is because we're reading Basil's captions to these photos. <laughs> Kel was still feeling a little sour about losing to Hero in an arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, uh, brotherly love. <laughs> oh. Me showing Sonny a book I've been reading. Mari stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I surely keep better track of my things. Well, that's all of them. Not all of them. That is Aubrey. That is Aubrey. That is all the kids. It's all of us cuddling with Sonny's stuffed animals. I have stuffed animals? <laughs> he has so many, and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Aw. <laughs> Mari's teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Sunny and Cal holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari thought so, it thought so too. <laughs> we haven't seen Mari in any of these photos, I've come to notice. We've only seen her- We've only seen, like, Underworld Mari. We haven't seen Mari at all in the- in the, like, the overworld almost. Which makes me- It's a little weird. You say I wonder why, but I'm just saying, like, it's a little we I mean, we know she's dead. It's not a secret that Mari's dead anymore. We literally- <laughs> They literally said Mari's dead. But I'm just saying, they haven't showed- Obviously, she's around for these photos. So I'm like, I wonder why she's not in any pictures. I mean, it's probably the game just being like, ooh, waiting. That's what I'm saying. These are old pictures, so it's just kind of odd that she isn't in any of these yet. Because these are all old, obviously. She's around for them, because they say Mari is Mari's crown. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his persistence. That's Aubrey. Oh, uh, that's why- Yeah, so Aubrey did used to have black hair, so she dyed it. Okay. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's raining super hard today. Rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with her new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. <laughs> that's why she dyed her hair pink. Huh. Oh. What is he doing? <laughs> Mori's like, oh. oh. Or Mori, Sonny is like, oh. Who is Amori then? <laughs> it's like, who is Amori? Oh my god. It's like... it's a... He's Sonny's nobody. <laughs> Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. <laughs> he says he likes how the rain tastes. Just Kel being Kel again. We went to Hobby's, but the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his comics wet. Sorry, shopkeep. Oh yeah, that's him behind a window. That's Kel again. He's been pretty busy with school lately, but we finally have made time to get together and go to the park today. Here's Kel hanging by his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. Wish I was as fearless as him. Oh, <laughs> it was that picture. <laughs> Wait, I think I saw an amazing picture at the bottom. It's the first day of summer vacation, so we all wanted to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel's cooling off with some refreshing orange Joe. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Kel is known to spill his drinks. The best picture. <laughs> <laughs> the best picture. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> it's him. <laughs> he has become sand. <laughs> Bro, he's vibing. Look at him. We buried Sonny in the sand. It took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. <laughs> Maybe. I wonder if he's going to need help getting out. I guess I'll keep him company until then. <laughs> he is vibing. Yeah, there's, like, no pictures of Mari yet. Yay, Sonny's turning 12 today. 
Even though me and me, Sunny, Aubrey, and Keller are in the same school year, Sunny's younger than all of us. Sunny's the youngest? Okay. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Oh. Sunny's the youngest. Sunny holding a super uh, huge present from Mario and Hero. Yeah, see? That's why I kept telling people, because everyone was like, I, someone was like, I wonder why, Zero. It's like, Mari is around at this time, but she's not in any picture. I wonder what it is. What is it? But Oh! Is that- Bu! It's him! It's me, wow! It's me, wow! This is the first time me wow's been in a photo! Where's my wow? <laughs> oh no. You can tell from the photo, but Mario and Hero got Sunny a giant building block set. Sunny seems much more interested in the box, though. <laughs> Sunny is an amazing character. <laughs> they got him a fucking building block set. He's just, he's more interested in the box. <laughs> Sunny wants the box. He acts just like Mari's new kitten, Meow. Oh, it was her, it's her cat. Oh. What? He slept in the box! <laughs> box? <laughs> now chat's just saying box. Sunny won't leave the box, so Kel put a food bowl inside. I guess this box would be Sunny Miwao's new home. They're just- they're just- they're chilling in a box. I'm back. Monica, look what I sent you! I see it. Oh We're, my god. He got a he got he got a violin for Christmas and they were like so he could perform recitals with his sister Mari. Mm -hmm. So that means he also played fucking violin. Also, we've been looking at pictures. We're going beetle catching today. Here's Cal ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Sonny's there too. He looks kind of sleepy. You haven't seen so you got some photos. This is him his birthday. Hero and Mari got him a present. He enjoyed the box more, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> he says he got him a giant building site. He's more interested in the box. Oh, and then Miwow's there, too. Look at him. Mm -hmm. And he slept in the box. <laughs> also, the best picture. <laughs> <laughs> he sleep. <laughs> hey, look, Aubrey's here. I've also been noti I've also been telling Chad how I've noticed Mari is not in any photo. Yeah. I went to the bathroom, came back to this photo. Cause he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. Wait, I just noticed something. What? Photos are missing. Mm-hmm. Cause there's maybe Aubrey. Maybe Aubrey took all the photos from that Mari was in. Yeah, so I was like, yeah, photo- I've never actually noticed that until now. I was like, yeah, wait, photos are missing. That actually might be what it is. I think they took the photos of Mari out of the thing. Oh, that, that's the same picture from the from the dream world, just in color now. Yeah, some of them are. It's the first day of school today. Me, Sunny, Kel, and Aubrey are up bright and early. Aubrey's so phonogenic. <laughs> they all are, weirdly <laughs> enough. Yeah. Because it's drawn. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Goodbye, Summer. Until next year. Wow, Monica got it first try. Monica got it because I pointed it out. <laughs> I when what? she literally came back, I said, there's no I said, oh wait, there's photos missing. And then you said, yeah, there is. And they're oh, like, yeah. Monica got it first try. And I'm like, Monica didn't even have time to say anything. <laughs> oh, I think he's talking about, like, my theory on why the photos are missing. No, I think it's because no? I... No, because I mentioned before, I was like, why do none of these photos have... Why do none of these photos have Mari in it? And then I was like, oh, wait, some of the photos are missing. Mm -hmm. I was like, Monica didn't get anything. Monica didn't even get a chance to get anything. <laughs> are you done looking at the photo album? Yes. Oh man, looks like a lot of photos are still missing. Maybe Aubrey kept them for herself. I'll yeah. get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. <laughs> okay, yeah, they are older. So then, yeah, wait. So yeah, that's why they're smaller in the dream world. That's the last time he saw them. 
in the dream world, they look like how they look in the photo album. They're younger because that's the last time Sunny saw them. In the overworld now, they're all older. They're at least four years older. Mm-hmm. So that's what I was like, yeah, it's like, th that's why the pictures are all, it's like, they're based, just based off of what Sunny last saw them. So now I wonder if they're gonna look different next time we go to the dream world. I wonder if they'll change. Maybe, Maybe yeah. <laughs> Aubrey's gonna be a bitch all of a sudden. <laughs> no, I've grown at least a, fo a foot since Hero left for college. Can't wait until he comes back. This year, I'll finally get be the taller brother. <laughs> Anyway, no sweat about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Sonny will take care of things for you. You just focus on going back to your happy, carefree self. Okay, thank you. I'll try. Yeah, if you compare the two worlds, you can piece you can piece some of the little details together to show how much thought was just was put into the story. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about the wait. Dinner is taking longer than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure. I'll help. I got some experience helping my brother cook and stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. Oh my god, I can save. Wait, yeah. this... Okay, finally. So now time to refight Aubrey! <laughs> oh. da -da 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 -da. I want to go out in the back. Because I know somebody's going to be upset if I don't do it. Right. Oh man, you're all the way back here. Not that far back. Still gathering from my, still gathering from what we saw. Stairs and a broken violin. I think Mari like fell down the stairs. Maybe. Actually, hold up, no. Oh fuck! <laughs> Don't worry, I'll win. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I won! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I did it. I win! My victory! <laughs> Sunny win! Sunny coming in clutch. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Now, fuck you. Hello, hello, priest. Hmm. You're the one who can help fighting in the middle of a sermon. That seemed really important. The girl Aubrey has come here every week for the past few years, but she never talks to anyone. I tried to approach her a few times, but she keeps calling me, uh, bad things. <laughs> she seems very troubled. Perhaps she could use a friend. <laughs> a grand piano. Well, the door. I mean, I'm, Back I, door. I, I know, I'm also examining. Oh my god! I will eat you. Ah, <gasps> <gasps> it's the graveyard. Old man. This lot's pretty quiet, isn't it? You can't you can't hear the hustle and bustle of the streets here at all. <laughs> Only thinks here are wandering spirits. Oh, and me, of course. <laughs> What's with that look? I ain't dead yet. <laughs> okay. Flowers. A headstone. This one has a bear on it. Yeah. Read them all. Hey, hey there's just his flowers. I can't read them. No, I mean, like, just click on them all. Headstone. 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 Just a bunch of fucking... Bunch of graves. Oh. Oh. There's a lot of graves. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> but I think that's the one you want to look at. <laughs> that one's the one that makes me sad. Our dearest Mari. The sun shined brighter when she was here. Mari. Feels like so long ago already. I still think about her all the time. I'm sure you do too. You know, when Mari passed away, Hiro... Hiro really stopped caring about everything. Oh no. Mm -hmm. He didn't want to get out of bed for school or even eat. Stop taking care of himself. Stop baking and cooking. It was like that for almost a year. Mom and Dad didn't know what to do either. We all tried to help him and be supportive, but... Nothing was really working. When 
night. I went over to him while he was all huddled in his blankets and started saying stuff. Stuff like how we all miss him and how we want him to get better. Everyone is really worried. How Mari wouldn't want to see him like this. I thought I was helping him, but... But Hiro... Hiro got angry. He suddenly got up and started screaming and yelling at me about a bunch of stuff. Some of it was pretty hurtful, too. But I think I blocked out a lot of it. His eyes were already super red. But the more he yelled at me, the harder he cried. I tried my best to calm him down. Whatever I said just made him worse. I had never seen Hiro do anything close to that before. It really took me by surprise. And I was so scared that... Well... I started crying too. Eventually, Mom and Dad ran to our room and rushed over to hug him and calm him down. But they... Completely ignored me. <laughs> I think that's where Hero got his senses back because he ran to me and hugged me right away. Just kept apologizing over and over. But at least Hero got a lot better after that. He started taking care of himself again. And focusing on school a lot more. And joining a bunch of extracurricular stuff. He's naturally good at everything, but he still works really hard, so I'm proud of him. I guess he's a little more closed off now than he used to be, but I'm really just glad to have my brother back. Anyways, uh, sorry for the long story. I don't think I've ever told anyone that before. It's not his fault, but I still think Harold blames himself for Mari's death. Harold's never visited here. Not even once. I know it really hurts, but maybe it might be good for him. I don't know. A uh, white egret orchid in the language of flowers it symbolizes the phrase "My thoughts will follow you into your dreams." <gasps> Scary. Oh. That's true. They do. Ah. <laughs> someone left a bag of bread at someone's gravestone. You hungry? <laughs> Scary. I like bread. Do you, do you see it? <laughs> There's bread? The There's bread. a bag of bread. It's funny. There's a bag of bread on <laughs> someone's grave. Bread! Bro, they're hungry. Bread. It smells toasty. Zero, take a look at the emotion chart next time. You get the chance. I don't think it's ever supposed to be talking about the game, but it's a nice touch, I think. Oh? Well, actually, I don't think I have the emotion chart anymore, huh? I have to go back into now. the... Yeah, I'll have to go back into the uh, other world. There you go. Because I don't have the emotion chart in the overworld. Wonder bread. Wonder bread for my wonder boy. <laughs> that's, what, that's what that's what it says. So yeah, I think that's that's the scene. Alright. Ah, that was worth it. That was a nice story. Yeah. It kinda reminds me of something Sonny's kind of acting like right now. Mm-hmm. So what they're trying to say is Sonny just needs to let it all out. I think so. He needs to fucking yell at somebody. <laughs> Sonny, yell at Kel right now. It's really weird how in the dream world his name is a Mori. I wonder why that is. Mori's his nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that word means something in some other language. Maybe a Mori's an anagram for something. Yeah. A Mori? Mari? Mm. <laughs> a Mori. I don't know. Amori? Amori? I'm trying to think right now. Amori? <laughs> uh, oh, wait, what about that one thing? That, um... Shit. Uh... What the fucking, what was it? The, 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 the like, Hiko thingy? What? The, um, the thing in Japan. There's a word in Japan where they use to describe people who, like, don't leave their house. Or anything. <laughs> I only know about this from Persona 3. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> I, I only know about this from Persona 3 because I think they mention it in Persona 3. It's like, I think it's, I think Futaba actually says it. I think it's Hikomori? Because she's like, I don't want you going Hikomori on me. Maybe. I don't know why I knocked. I didn't mean to do this. <laughs> 
Yeah, it is Hiko Mori. Okay, yeah, chat saying that. Yeah, okay, yeah. That may I think that that's why his name's Amori. Hiko Mori. Because he's <laughs> locked up in his house. Yeah. That's what Amori stands for, probably. Maybe. He's all locked up in his house and he never leaves. Mm hmm. I think it's. They, they, uh, I think it's. Amori directly translates to wait. No, yeah, that's why it's not. It's not a direct translation. I'm pretty sure it's based off of Hikomori. Yeah. Yeah. It's based off the word Hikomori. Because he does not leave his house. Oh, yeah. Or you could take weight as the word. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could think of it as weight. I guess weight kind of works, too. <laughs> it directly translates to weight, and it's like, I guess. I mean, I guess it kind of works in this situation. Yeah, yeah, basically a hermit. Yes, that is what Hikomori means. You basically become a hermit, which is kind of what Sunny is, as we saw from the beginning. <laughs> and never yeah, leaving yeah. his house for four years. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, because his fucking sister died when he was a like a young kid. He was like he was twelve. He just turned twelve. Mm-hmm. Cause well, that was his birthday, right? They said he turned twelve. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. Yeah, cause now he's sixteen. What? What? Why did uh, I thought the game crashed oh. or something something clicked out of my Something tried to help. Oh, fucking GeForce game ready. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, you gotta update. Oh, does that mean I gotta update my GeForce driver, bro? Fucking, it's fucking dumb. Okay. Your GeForce the game ready. Imagine big sad moment happening. Your GeForce ready driver <laughs> freezes because GeForce ready driver. Your driver's ready to update. Okay, we can leave this now. The game has to know that I that looked at all the photos. <laughs> the game must know. I have to make sure the timeline is the same. There we go. This makes me, this makes me sad. <laughs> yeah, it's a sad game, Monica. <laughs> Shut up. He lost his sister and he's like 12. Oh, wait, hold up. Was Kel... So wait, were they... Four... Does that mean Kel's like 20 now? 20? Oh no, he's like 16 right now. Because well, he was 12 when all this happened. So that means now he would have to be... No, at least they're around his age. So Kel will be 17. Because even though he's the quote-unquote baby of the group, I doubt he's that much younger than them, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, even, even if Sonny's the baby of the group, I doubt he's that much younger. Especially considering the fact they were friends, so, yeah. Yeah, they're all around the same age. So, yeah, it's like, I'm assuming they're, like, yeah. They're, like, two years older at most. Yeah, that's what I was saying, yeah. I was like, they're, like, they have to at least be, like, two years older at most. And also, because I was like, if he was 20, he'd be in Oh! College. If you look at the save, look at the saves thing again. What? Amori looks younger, while Sunny looks older. Oh my god, he is, yeah. He's like a child. Amori is like 12. He's got baby face. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got more mature face. <laughs> yeah. His face is bigger. <laughs> he, gr he grew into his head. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's baby. <laughs> he's baby. <laughs> Amori's baby. Amori's baby. He's baby. Yeah, that's why in the like dream world, they all wear a bunch of like baby clothes, like a bunch of like, like long dress and stuff. Yeah, because anyway, they're should, very young kids. We should turn off tech skip before I accidentally do that. <laughs> there we go. Yep. All right. Um, How long have you been going for? I want to go for more. Three hours. Three hours? You want to go for more? Yes. Screw you. Mm -hmm. ah. Ah. Amori. Amori. <laughs> Hello, parts. Who the fuck is this? Who the fuck is this? Oh, it's Grandma! Grandma, no! Grandma's dying. Because the grandma's breathing steadily. Oh, no. Why are the, we it's, here? The, it's the flower. <laughs> Oh, that's what it looks like. It's the it's the orchid that was by that was by Mari's grave. 
Yeah. By Egrid Orchid. It's the language of the flower. It symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Hmm. Ah! Huh? I'm sorry! Jesus. Oh, Sonny, I didn't expect to see you in here. <laughs> How are you doing, Sonny? Is everything okay with you? Okay. N never mind then. Grandma can't hear us, you know. She hasn't been feeling very well recently. It's already been four years, hasn't it? Nice to see that you're still around, even if it's only for a little while. Here, take my photo album. I want you to have it. I'm trusting you with it, okay? I just think you can probably use it more than me. Hazel gave you his photo album. A lot has happened since these pictures were taken. Sometimes it feels like it was all a bad dream. It's hard to remember now, but I think, at the time, I took photos of what I was most afraid to lose. Flipping through this album, you can still see the good times. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Sonny! Basil! Dinner's ready! Okay, coming! Gra Graham Graham. Goodbye, Graham Graham. She ain't your Graham Graham. She stole Graham Graham. <laughs> ah! Jesus oh. Christ, don't do that to me, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Sonny jump scare. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> that's that's the horror in Amori. The fucking whether or not you're gonna get a mirror cutscene. <laughs> uh, Jesus. <laughs> Like, oh my god, don't do that to me, kid! Hazel's camera. Looks really dusty. Watering pail. Dusty. Water plant. Or does somebody say dusty? Dusty? And he goes meow when he comes in. Meow. No, it's not dusty. Meow. 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 Me wow. Me wow. Or what they eating? I don't want to eat. I'm gonna watch TV. Oh, that, that's that's a great show. Someone was telling me to keep talking to Basil, so I guess we missed like some dialogue if we kept trying to talk to Basil before. But like, I don't. Oh. But he bugged in and forced it, so it doesn't sound like it mattered that much. <laughs> okay. Just a bit of dialogue. Oh, okay. So I can overwrite my save file and not worry about it. Okay. He gets really shy if you keep talking to him. Oh. <laughs> okay. It's just extra dialogue of Basil being shy, trying to make conversation. You desperately forcing Basil to make conversation, you mean man. I don't want to eat, guys. I want to sit on the couch. I'll talk to him here. Don't worry, guys. I got you. Damn it. Doesn't do it anymore. Kel, what are you doing? What took you so long? Plan, I worked really hard on this. I have to take a seat, Sonny. Hope I actually fucking don't. Hope I don't fucking. Hope I don't throw up this time. Let's go. Please eat some actual food, Sonny. You haven't eaten anything, actually. Wait. He yeah. needs food, dude. And they taste so he good. Does. You're the best, Polly. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just following Grandma's recipes. Thanks for your help, Kel. <laughs> so as I was saying before, Polly, tomorrow. My older brother Hero is finally coming back from college. Oh my god, we get to talk to Hero. Mom's all crazy him. right now, preparing the house and everything. <laughs> Don't want to be anywhere near that mess. Although, I'm pretty excited to see him. Every time he comes back, the first thing we do is compare heights. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I'll make him. Uh, Don't worry, guys. I'll, I'll add to the immersion. Hold up. 
I gotta, He's going to get I gotta, food. I gotta improv here. I gotta do it correctly. <laughs> He's gotta get his pecan swirls out. It's the only piece of food I have nearby me. You always have pecan swirls. You're just you have like a black hole in your room that just pops out pecan swirls. I'm in empty space. I'm in white space. I have never I've never heard of a time where you didn't have your pecan swirls. Alright, don't worry guys, I got this. I could have ate some Skittles and put those in my mouth actually. <laughs> yeah, because you have like four bags that you need to eat. I only have two now. This have year? you eaten- have you eaten mine? No, shut up. Exactly. You're you interrupting the cutscene, lady? Can you, like... <laughs> <laughs> Are, can you nag me later? Yeah. This year is the year that I'm finally gonna be <laughs> taller than I am. I can feel it in my bones. What is that? Stuff a cotton ball in your mouth. Oh shit, she doesn't have food in her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta swallow. <laughs> you and your brother seem close. That's good. Family's important. Yeah. Oh hey. Oh fuck. <laughs> Damn it. Gotta take another bite. Oh hey. <laughs> what you doing with bears of fire on there, Sonny? Sonny, put some food in your mouth! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I... I gave it to him. I just thought he should have it. <laughs> wow, really? That's so cool of you. Makes sense. Wow. Especially since Sonny's moving away and all. What? Sonny's... M moving? Wait, I thought you knew! Oh, I thought he knew. He said, he said that we, wait, wait, what? But he said about me leaving. I don't think he knew that yet, though. What was he thinking I was referring to then? Uh, I don't know. Oh, I don't yeah. think you said it to him. I thought you said it to Aubrey. No, but it's made it sound, but I thought he knew because the way he talked was like he knew. Oh. Yeah, I thought I already mentioned it. I must have forgot. He's moving in. Three days, I think. Sorry, I already knew. Oh. Uh. No, I guess I must have missed it. Why else would you give me your photo album? S sorry. Um. May I be excused? I. I have to go to the bathroom. He's very torn up about that. Well, yeah, Monica, he's probably. Oh. Could go check on him. What's up with him? Well, that's just how it is. You gotta go, you gotta go. Tittle more. Or did Sonny eat? No. <laughs> He's gonna starve to death at the end of this game. Three days left, that's when he dies of starvation. <laughs> is he in the bathroom? Why is oh. the bathroom always a not a nice place? <laughs> Oh, no. Everything's going to be okay. 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 Oh, it's you, Sonny. You're here. I'm so glad. You, you can see it too, can't you? Something behind you. What? Oh, I can- oh, oh no. Um, uh, ah! Oh, oh no. Oh, uh, wait! Oh, he's Please, so Sonny! Don't leave me! Not again! Oh. What? Oh, of course. Oh, no, he left. <laughs> oh no! Go back in there! <laughs> <laughs> was not supposed to do that! <laughs> My apologies! My apologies, <laughs> That's what Bug just said. Bug said, time. be careful, leaving will lock you out of- Oh. <laughs> um. Hey, it's right. me, Buzzanos! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Or way to ruin this scene. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wait, it says behind you, right? Oh, no. <laughs> Is it our good old friend? 
all oh, the Maury's, Maury's ghost? Is it our si is it our pal? Our friend? Our amigo? Oh, that's not our that's friend. That oh, that's our new friend, <laughs> Mr. Yeah. I. It's that guy. I'm gonna look at him again. <laughs> I'm gonna look at him. <laughs> he's just he's just your he's your familiar. He's my persona. <laughs> Sunny. Well, why? Why do you look so scared? Why do you look so why scared? Why do you look so scared? Is there anything also, else to do here? I just looked in here? the mirror. I, didn't, I don't look scared. What do you mean? I look fine. See? Yeah, he doesn't look scared. <laughs> Alright, so now I can leave appropriately. <laughs> Talk to him again. Sunny. Everything is okay now, isn't it? Sonny, why? Okay, no, yeah, oh. he's just saying the same stuff. I think now we leave, right? Yeah, I think now we leave. I can, n n n I'm gonna go home now. <laughs> I wanna know why he's so, like, fucked up over that. I don't think he accepted Mari's death pretty well, Monica. I guess so, huh? I think huh? I can leave now, goodbye. Wait, please, Sonny, don't leave me. Not again. Bye, Basil. Have a good time. Oh no, he did a different thing now. I thought, wait, no, I think he went on the floor before. Yeah, he did. Okay. I'm gonna go talk to Grandma. Grandma! Hello, Grandma. Grandma, help! <laughs> Grandma, Basil's weird! This is scary music now. I don't know why I thought this would happen. Yeah, now he's crying. Okay, no, that was new? Oh, okay. Him crying was oh. new. It's because we looked at the mirror. Guys. Basil's pooping on the floor. Hey, Sonny. I think it's about time we went home. It's way past my curfew. So, yeah. Anyway, Polly, if you ever need me, here's my address. I live just down the block. Thanks, Kel. You're sweet. <laughs> no, it's nothing. Say goodbye to Basil for me. I just noticed something. So, yeah. So, that was also something I've noticed. Kel. So. So, now that we finally figured this out. And that Kel is kind of doing what I wanted to talk about. Kel has been. I don't know. I could be a little wrong here. It, so, you know how in the, in the other world. Kel acts like a little shit. <laughs> and he's like. Really like annoying and stuff but like in the overworld so far he's like trying to be like really helpful to everybody it kind of feels like he's trying to be like hero yeah like now that he's like now that hero's like gone it's like, it kind of feels like he's trying to be the new hero for like like around everywhere because like because you ever notice how like hero was constantly like at, like let's like helping people and constantly being like hey you know if you ever need help it does seem that way if you look at it like that. He's a big grown up now. Yeah, like that's a, not saying it's a bad thing, of course. It just kind of shows that he kind of looks up to his brother. It shows how much he looks up to him to where it's like now he's acting like hero. <laughs> 16 years old, basically a foot in the grave. <laughs> or you know those old 16 year olds. Say goodbye to Basil for me. Oh, that's you breathing. You scared the shit out of me. I was like, what's that fucking noise? I was, <laughs> I was yawning. Yeah, I was about to talk about that too, and I didn't know if it was intentional. Basil wasn't in the mirror, but that thing was. No, I just thought that was just because Basil But it was yawning. where Basil was in the mirror. Oh. Doesn't that little ghostly thing mean- What the fuck was that? A car! Oh. <laughs> Calm down, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I thought it was the black ghost thing flying at the bottom. <laughs> That's a car. <laughs> ah! Now I'm Basil. <laughs> it is a sign of character development in a way if you take the other world as an act reference of how it was before. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I was just like, him being like that is because he was a kid, and then this shows that him older, he actually ended up becoming just like his brother. And I'm like, that's cute. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, this is not my house. Oh, that is my house. 
<laughs> but it has the box in it. That's not your house. Oh, wait, never mind. It's not my house. You don't even know where your house is. That's not I, your house either. This isn't my I have to go up. I forgot. We're at the church. Actually, would they let you? Would they have let you back in the church at nighttime? Nope. Nope. Well, good thing we did that then. We couldn't even do it at nighttime. <laughs> I know oh, that no, was a car. Please. Shut up. <laughs> Keep talking like that. I'm going to bully you. You went past your house. I'm going to the park. Did you ever figure out why that tree was shaking? <gasps> There's a guy on there. There's a kitty up there. We did. That's what have. that's what they were hiding. Like we said, the hobo's still here. <laughs> <laughs> well, where are they gonna go? They don't have a home. Hey, bub, could you spare a few nickels? Really appreciate it. Aw. We gotta give the... Here you go. Give him ten bucks. Yeah. It's a smelly hobo. Thank you kindly. Hey, bub, thanks for helping me. You've been a real friend. So, I got something special for you. Hold out your hands for me and close your eyes. Okay. Ew. Ew. Let me cold in your palms. Ew. You. A gold oh. watch? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Okay. How do you have a watch? <laughs> you Man's like it? He's asking for money and he can sell it. He's been so gracious, though I could spare some of my wares. <laughs> That's a real gold there, I swear it. How the fuck? No, it's Why not. It no, then? it's quotations gold. Don't lie to me. Yeah, it's, because well, he would have sold that if he needed it. It's the quotations gold, like the other watch. And yeah, is yeah. that even real gold? Well, yeah, he still helped him. Yeah. I'll put it on. <laughs> oh, that was nice. Helped out a man. Bunch of cats. All these goddamn cats. And this guy. <sighs> oh, this old hobo, right. Tonight's such a beautiful night, don't you think? I mean, I have money, but at least Moonlight is free. Aw. Well, at least he's enjoying the, <laughs> the other parts of life. Alright, well, time to go back home. Gram Gram's so. waiting for me. I don't you have don't a Gram Gram. Nobody's waiting for me at home. That is the You present. have a mommy. She's not even home. Oh. Actually, I should probably stop at Kel's house, right?